going on everyone welcome back to texas honda channel if you're new here definitely subscribe um so we got my honda pilot back so you've seen it here on this channel first i'll be posting one of james d guy as well check out the link in the description for that channel uh, sorry about the wind everyone but basically we got the honda pilot back i built this over a year ago uh, it's marvel themed if you're wondering what shield is it's strategic homeland intervention enforcement logistics division it is for the Marvel series. If you've watched Avengers, you should know the logo right there on the door. I wrapped or, or bedlined this with Rust-Oleum Bedliner over a year ago and it's holding up wonderfully. So I'm gonna go ahead and do a little walk around for you. We have the brush guard, which I painted with the Rust-Oleum Bedliner over Chrome. It's chipping a little bit, but over a year of driving, 7,000 miles did pretty good the paints holding up beautifully hasn't chipped off or faded or anything they upgraded the tires because they needed replaced when I had it but uh, I bed coated these wheels out of the can and it's holding up strong too over a year later um, all this is painted on this is all spray can painted which right here you can kind of see where I screwed up but it's whatever uh, I made it as a replica to the shield vehicle that they drive in Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. on Netflix. If you haven't watched it, guys, definitely go. It's really good series. Um, ties into all the Marvel movies, too, so it's really cool. Uh, did all that, and I did the seats inside. As you can see, I did seat covers, and I pressed these on with the uh, vinyl, um, cut them out of my vinyl machine, and did all that. But yeah, it, they did a really good job at taking care of it over a year, and two different owners owned this, and I finally got it back um, when we went to Kansas, so light bar still works it's just amber and white i'll show you right here but yeah it's uh definitely holding up really strong the lights still work everything still works and is how i had it so i'm super impressed and super happy to have it back i've been wanting it back we needed a three-row vehicle because i have four kids a wife me and then sometimes casey tags along so now we have three rows without having a minivan and we have something cool to drive around in a lot of people think I'm a cop, so they go to, go to speed by me, and then you'll see them slam on their brakes. So it's kind of hilarious to watch, but uh, this is the only issue in the entire year that it's had. The rear bumper, someone ran into the back of it, a drunk driver. It didn't actually do any damage, really, to the bumper. It just chipped all the paint off, which is a simple, easy refix of spraying um, since the truck been coated. The exhaust sounds beautiful. I'll definitely put a clip right here of that. I have this old build on my other channel, the James D Guy channel. Link will be below. Definitely check out that channel um, of me. I painted this and put all this stuff on there. So definitely check it out, guys. This was one of my favorite vehicles that I've put together. Uh, it drives great. Uh, we did, I think, 90 the whole way here to Texas, and it handled it beautifully. We got it, picked it up in Kansas. I traded my G35 uh, camo one, this one right here. For this, the guy said that I can get my G35 back if I build him a zombie apocalypse type vehicle. So I'm definitely going to be building him a vehicle because I, I like my G35. But I loved this thing more than any, so I had to get it back. We needed three rows anyways. But since it's a Honda, I decided why not put it on the Texas Honda channel and let my Honda fans see it. So if you see me in Texas, definitely uh, honk your horn something, get my attention. Um, I don't pretend to be a cop in this, I don't. But we do go to Comic-Con and stuff like that, and we'll dress up to fit the theme. Uh, but yeah, I don't I don't try to pull people over, none of that stupid stuff. It's just fun, good daily AC, power steering, all the good stuff. Because on Hondas, I always rip that crap out. <laughs> because more power, right? So definitely uh, stay tuned to the channel. I'll have more on Casey Civic. In the next video, I will be painting the engine bay on the race car Civic. We're going color shift, which is the color changing spray paint. Um, I've done it on multiple bays. I'll put a clip right here. That's how it looked with the engine bay. Um, with the color shift, we'll be doing that on the Coupe Civic in the backyard. So we'll be painting it yellow, doing that, but we'll be painting the bay in the next video. So definitely stay tuned. Like this video. If you're new to the channel, definitely consider subscribing. Uh, drop me a comment. Let me know what you guys think of my cool Honda Pilot. I missed having this thing, and I'm so excited to have it back. So 
we'll be using this as our daily to go get race car parts it's has plenty of room so definitely uh stay tuned guys and uh see you in the next video